Hello everyone, my name is Rahul and welcome to my channel Rahul QA Labs. So in today's tutorial, we'll be learning how to install Jira or how to access Jira on Windows. As you all know that Jira is a very popular bug tracking tool and many of the IT companies are using that. Uh, it is a project management uh, tool that is being used, uh, you know, by creating a dashboard and creating different workflows and sprints. Uh, you can manage your project, you can manage all the issues, you can track the uh, you know performance of the teams and uh, the status of the project etc so uh, it's a very popular tool in today's agile world and uh, today we'll be uh, learning how to uh, uh, do installation of the tool so let's start this is the website uh, www.atlassian.com so Atlassian is the company uh, uh, who has uh, developed uh, Jira Let's copy this website. Yeah, so uh, like I've already opened it. So see, uh, if you go to the products, so there are so many, you know, different versions of uh, Jira and other uh, products as well. So for our tutorial, we will click on this Jira software. Okay, so it says the number one software development tool used by Agile teams. Uh, we will click on uh, get it free. So here we have uh, three versions or you can say three flavors of Jira. This is only the Jira software uh, where you can plan, track and release world class softwares. Uh, this one is a combination of Jira software plus uh, the documentation. And the third one will be the Jira software and help desk. So for our tutorial, we'll be using the cloud version of Jira and uh, let us select the second option that we have choose to. And uh, here it is asking to sign up uh, for, uh, you know, you have to create an account and then we can proceed forward. So see here Jira software cloud free. So like it's a free uh, cloud software that we'll be using. So let's create an account quickly. Sign up with the email. Uh, you can click, uh, you can write your email here. Okay, so I have selected this email. Uh, it has already populated the name. Uh, sorry, just give the password as per your choice and click on agree. So it is creating the account. Yes. So it says that uh, we have mailed a verification link to your email and uh, we need to verify that link. So let us go to Gmail. And select our email address. Okay, so here is the email. Almost there, please verify your email ID. So just click on yes, verify me. Your email ID will get verified and let's see what comes up. Okay, name of your site. So what name you want to give or uh, like, it's asking the site name. So, I'll give here Rahul QA Labs 1. Okay, so a green tick is here. That means uh, this name is available. Click on continue. Now it is asking for uh, like what type of team do you work in? So I would say software development and QA engineer. Now, uh, if you have uh, any teammates you want to invite, so these are the options available. You can give their email address and you can invite them. So as of now, uh, let me check. Let me give my another email ID as of now. Click on continue and uh, help us set up this Jira. I am new to Jira. 
or uh, you are experienced with Jira like as per your experience you can uh, select the option click on experienced my team is new to agile methodologies and we spend our time working on uh, fixing bugs i'll take this option and we have a tight schedule to finish our work so after answering all these questions click on next it will ask you to select uh, which template or which format you want uh, in your firm is it uh, like kanban or it is it is it a scrum or is it a bug tracking so i will select a scrum now you need to enter a project name so uh, demo project one and it has given you a key so key is nothing but uh, uh, whichever issues uh, you will raise so there will be a prefix uh, in those issues that will be dem so if i click on here so read this the project key is used as a prefix of your project issues keys example test dash one double zero okay so this will be uh, appended uh, in starting of the issues that you will be raising and uh, we are following the scrum methodology so just click on create and yes this is your uh, you can say a dashboard all the options are available here this is the cloud version we are using uh, this is the name of the demo project one and uh, all these options are present here backlog active sprints uh, Reports issues components. So a lot of options are there. So as of now, we don't have any issues created So in our later tutorials, we'll uh, see the options one by one and we'll uh, try to understand what what each of the options means So for today's tutorial, that's it. I hope uh, you all must have got some idea on how to uh, you know access jira in your uh, personal systems and thank you very much for watching this tutorial if you like my video please uh, do share your feedback and uh, subscribe my channel and always keep sharing your knowledge thank you very much bye bye